Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Fallout 2. This is Colonel RPG as usual, and I'm very happy that I chose to join me today again as I get out of Klamath and get myself uh, into a lot of trouble. Yes, we are getting ourselves into a lot of trouble. We're looking for Smiley. Smiley the Trapper got himself, well, it's just a lot of trouble, as I said. It's, I'm, I hate repeating myself, but really, it's, it's what it is. It really is what it is. We are going to the Toxic Caves, and in here, oh boy, we have geckos already. Oh, spate. What exactly are we dealing with? We are just... Oh, let's... Can you tell me what you are? I need to go over there. A little gecko. Not too bad. Not too bad. So last episode, we got ourselves uh, some boots. A pretty important uh, aspect of this whole operation. So we got effectively a 20% increase here um, of our to hit chance, which is not enough to account for the damage differential over here. Although at this point, it's better to take a punch. Nice. How much? Four points of damage. Let's hope that I hit right now and can and can tell. Ooh, nice of you. Yeah, Sulik is really powerful as Sledgehammer. He really good. Sulik really good. Hopefully this guy... Oh, how much damage was that? Was that? It's just random. I need to look at the damage output. Hopefully he doesn't attack me or doesn't attack Sulik. And he goes down. Look at that. Okay. So here we are. I gained 55 experience points and I can't get anything from these little guys. But yeah, we got boots. Rubber boots. Very, very important. Because of this. Radioactive goo. Again, not, nothing out of the ordinary. My idea is to be able to... Let me quick save over here. My idea is to be able... Ooh, we have more of these guys. Just to be able to sneak in and out of this place without actually being seen. Which probably isn't gonna happen, mind you. It's, uh, it's, it's probably not gonna happen. But I really would like to come back. Ooh, thank you, Sulik. You're very nice. I hope he's attacking me. Uh, it's probably not gonna happen because... Yeah, just the nature of this place. And also because we have terrible... T oh, that's for Sulik. Okay, so is he dead? He's not dead. Let's punch him and then flee. This guy's going for... Oh, I, I missed! Oh, he's coming for me. One point of damage. Ooh, six points of damage. Ah, I was gonna bite my face. Oh, that guy is, is angry. They don't care. Oh, he's dead. That's, that's, yeah, don't, they don't care about the radioactive goo. 35% chance to hit. Come on, give me something. Five points. I really don't want, don't want to need to... Uh... Well, I got something here for you, little guy. I got something here for you. So is gonna teach you a lesson. Actually, he might not. Well, uh, but it's probably not. This guy's unhurt. Ooh, I just punch him for two points of damage. Yeah, a spear is really what I need here. Or at least I, I can see better over here. Uh, Sulik just took damage. Oh, Sulik is such a nice guy. He comes and helps me. 26% chance to hit. That's not good enough. I think I need to go for the punches here. 35 Oh, come on. I missed and lost my next turn. Oh my god, this is gonna be so bad. It's gonna be so bad. Please don't get hurt, Minsk. Uh, not Minsk, sorry. Solik. Oh, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. This was a terrible idea. These guys are really, really tough. I mean, it's... it's. I, I, can, I can heal me. I heal myself, I should say. But I really don't want to because this was a bad approach. So, uh, Ron Perlment. Perlment? I always say that. You died. I, I know, I said your name wrong, and I died because of that. Uh, I always say the name wrong. I, I'm sorry. I'm, I, I'm sorry. That It's just, I don't know. Okay, oh, that is nasty. That is nasty. That guy saw me. I was going to try and sneak. Uh, okay, is he coming after me? Oh, he's not. Oh, we might be able to kite him then. Hmm. This is going to be a really tough battle, by the way. A uh, really tough, not battle, but, you know, really tough area. Uh, simply because Solik is not... Oh, Solik, go for it. Okay, so I don't know who he's attacking. Ooh, that nice one. That was really, really nice. Can I attack him from here? Yes, I can. 77. And I got a miss, of course. Let's get out of here. No, no. He's knocked out. He's knocked out. He's almost dead. Punch him. Punch him. I knocked him out. That's really lucky. That's actually a very useful strategy is to go for the eyes most of the time for crits. Uh, and get them to die and then you or to not get knocked out and then you can do stuff So I'm gonna try and sneak in that's not gonna happen not with these guys over here. Oh, man And the smoke I never noticed their smoke did I I don't think so Maybe it's because my screen can see it and other screens can't because I got a screen here that uh, Actually works a little bit better with the low light visibility things but that guy's gonna see me. Please see me mr. Lizard No, oh, man, they're making slappy 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 noises and not the nice ones. 
Oh, they don't see me. Yeah, I want to go down there. But in general, I want to go around here. I want to need to kill these guys. Oh, he doesn't... Oh, there he is. Okay, he's coming. Okay, I might be able to... Actually, I will be able to attack him. Uh, but it's just going to be a really bad idea if I do that. Let's just not be do that and uh, just go. Hopefully, Sulik decides to run. Yes, he does. And, uh, yeah, the idea here is to... I sh I I'm really going to need to... Got a little bit better on melee. We're not going to learn anything else. We have learned pretty much everything that we can learn in terms of melee. So it's not too bad. That's something I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Seven points of damage. Um, I can sh I can punch you once and then try to flee. At least... Oh, no. No. I'm just going to kite you around Sulik. Oh, no. Uh, Sulik's taking damage. Sulik is pretty strong, though. Sulik has, like, a million health. He's, he's pretty, pretty buff. I'm out of range? I'm not. Who's he coming for? Solik again. Come on, Solik, you can do better. I know you can do better. I've seen you do better. Nah. Nah. Okay, he's still coming for Solik. It's much better. Come on, 35%. Come on, RNG. I know you're BS in this game, but don't let me down right now. Four points of damage. Oh no, don't drop your weapon. Oh, he hurt himself for 11 points. At least he didn't lose his next turn. Or destroy his weapon, which would be, well, not as bad, because, to be honest, I, I got plenty of those. I got another one, mind you. Oh, did I sell it? Okay, let's keep an eye on him. Severely wounded. He's gonna be fine. But this is going badly. Okay. Sulik was hit, and this guy is almost dead. But I'm really gonna, ooh. Sulik is gonna die. Yeah, I'm not gonna be able to do that like that. Not gonna be able to do that like that. We're gonna need to man up, basically, and uh, and get ourselves some proper skill points, basically. Let's do this properly, then. Okay, so I have a gun that I can't really shoot at all, and I have um, I have a, a perk that I actually forgot to check and, uh, and and see what I wanted. So I'm probably gonna go with comprehension. Comprehension is pretty good um, because you are gonna need science, and I'm really dumb. My science is at 30. Uh, and skill books are not enough to bring your, your science up by a whole lot. That said, comprehension... Uh, I would really benefit from that if I didn't spend anything on small guns. Uh, and if I were able to uh, to get through this... You know what? I can get through this. Uh, I can get through this if I just save scum. I really didn't want to do that, though. I mean, it's a completionist run. I know, I know, but... Uh... Let's see. Thief is really boring. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go with... Awareness is good, but not as good. I don't really like it that much. So, let's just specialize. Let's be true to our nature. Yeah, we're gonna be... We're gonna have small guns, but I'm only gonna, only gonna bring that up when we uh, actually... Uh, when we actually can, uh, need to use it. So, I'm gonna use melee. Bring it up. No, actually, I shouldn't. Because I'm, I'm really trying to keep my uh, skill expenditure uh, down. Expenditure, rather. So let's go into unarmed. That's going to be our trait. Or not trait, but our, our thing. 80% should be okay to let us fight a little bit. At least hold our own. And I'm going to take a few shots. And that's going to be how I roll. Let's see what happens. Uh, it's probably going to be terrible. But those guys at least have... I've got visual. I got visual. Yeah, come on. Come at me, little guy. There he is. Okay. So what's the hit chance right now? 41. That's not too bad. And I got a 58 over here. Yeah, I might as well take a shot, right? I got a shot. Three hit points. That's not bad at all. Of course, it's a oh, 51 over here. That's really bad, actually. Oh, Sulik on the run. Oh, my God, that was good. And there's another one. Some, oh, there's another one over there. Oh, I'm with the kicks. I shouldn't be using the kicks because... Oh, he critically missed and crippled his left arm. Not that it's going to affect him in any way, but... Oh, I'm missing a bunch. Come on. Oh, he's off. Oh, Sulik. Oh, we got this. That was so lucky. Oh, yeah, he's gonna now going to start combat every time, but that's okay. That was so lucky. You guys don't even know. Okay, I don't want to go... I don't want to... I don't want to use the kicks. Because in this game, in the first game, you didn't have that. But in this game, you have a kick and a punch, depending on where you have your, um, your melee weapon. So that guy is going to be crippled forever. I'm going to save the game there. And I'm going to try and get, in, get into a fight with him. Uh, just see what happens. Okay, so he's, he's pretty pissed. And he's uh, kind of okay to, to be pissed. So, oh, he's not... 
Hmm. He's not running anymore. It's kind of lame. Or is this the right, the wrong guy? I think he might have been the wrong guy. Let's throw a few punches and get out of there. See? Oh yeah, it's the wrong guy. Good, good. So we're doing a little bit of damage, not too much, but this is definitely going better. Unarmed seems to be. We have, we inherited inherited some traits from from Jesse from the previous game. That's okay. Our ancestor has taught us a few things. He didn't really, but I mean, of course not. But this is gonna be really tough. I do have some healing powder, but and that's gonna be what we need. But we can always rest. It's not a problem. Time is not the issue in this game. Let's see how this guy is looking. Severely wounded. Okay, not too good. Minsk is um. I say Minsk. Sulik is really the only guy that's actually doing any damage over here. But he's not. Oh, well, hopefully I don't die. Like that. That was not a critical. Huh. The wasteland has claimed your life. Yes, it has. Yes, it has. Okay, I could I probably should have um, should have taken a um, should have taken a uh, Okay, so that guy's pissed. Awesome, he's coming in. He's coming in, that's great. That's much better now. Okay, I can't do anything, so I'm gonna just stay over here. So he comes in. And uh, takes a hit for six points of damage. Takes two hits for six, uh, five. Okay, and I can keep punching. I'm gonna be hit now. Okay, this is going much better. I really would like. Oh, he's going for Misk. Oh, damn it, Sulik! Oh, this is good. I can't aim my punches. He's almost dead. But at least I hit all of them. Oh, come on, Sulik! Oh, Fifty percent. That's a punch. Oh, that's a miss. That's a dodge. Five points. We like the inside just the way they are, men, says says Sulik. Okay. Oh, he's coming for me. That's good. I like that. I'm not as much really. But down he goes. Okay. Um Hey Sulik. What you be needing? Uh so can you consult spirits the spirits? Be willing to talk. What about this place? That which is a door does not always lead to anywhere. That which is not a door does. That's not helpful. Also, especially what in this place. Uh, so, I want you to wait here. This look like a good place to sit back for a bit. Yep, that's it for now. It's not really a good place, but I want him to stay there because I want to go over there uh, without him actually bothering me. Uh, let's go over here. And our boots protected us and didn't melt. That guy's gonna... Oh, is, that... is he a new one? No, he's not. Fantastic. Okay, let's... Uh... Can I look for traps? No, not in combat. Is he gonna run away? Oh, Sulik. What are you doing, my man? What are you doing? You're go your boots are gonna melt. You shouldn't do that. Oh, by the way, this is a, completion a completionist run, but I'm not gonna do the thing that you probably can do. And maybe should do if you're having fun. That guy's not helping me, though. Sulik is a terrible, terrible friend. I told you Sulik! Are you kidding me right now? I didn't... Mm. Well, in that case... Yeah, these 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 geckos are terrible. What you be? Let's go. Yeah. What you be? That's good. That's good. Okay. So because I don't have a gun for you, you'd be so much better with this. This is really the hard mode, really. Okay. So that guy's running away. I'm fine with that. Do I have anybody around here? Yes, I do. I have that guy over there. But what am I gonna do with him? Is he gonna come? No, he doesn't. Okay. I can. Uh, do I have a, a pipe gun over here? Take a shot. That's something. Minus 35% chance to hit. That's that's quite something. But at least he hears me, I think. Yes, he does. Awesome. Okay. Can I shoot him? Minus 14. Yeah, I can. Ish. Okay. Sank back. See what he does. So we might be able to get him. Yes, he can. Okay. So I'm a little bit hurt. I'm gonna take a punch and move this way and keep his attacks to one. And so they can do that. So I throw a punch. And do this. It's one attack. It's a single attack, right? There. Oh, come on. That was good. That was gonna be good. Okay. Uh, let's take a healing powder right now. And there we go. We gain nine hit points and, of course, lose one perception, which is bad because. Keep to Get to. Oh, come on. Sometimes. Oh! oh, I knocked myself out. Oh, boy. I'm so bad. I, I'm so bad. I punched this guy and I knocked myself out. Sulik is not bad though. Okay. Can I punch him? Yeah. Come on. 50% RNG. Oh, of course. Okay. Yeah. The, the problem with losing perception is that you actually hit. It's harder for you to hit as you figure, right? 
Okay. Take a punch, or throw a punch and get out of there. Let's slowly do the job there. Oh, come on. See if I can go around. He's is he crippled or something? There we go. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. 10 hit points of damage. Can't punch him. Okay, fall back. Let him come. Ouch. Three points. Oh, come on. Oh, seriously? He's almost dead. He sh this is not going to go well. Ah, oh, come on. No. I can fix that. Ooh. There is a way to kite these guys with Zulik. He just, you know, knocked it out. I'm going to take a little bit of damage, but that's okay. Look at this. Look at this. Just go over there. See? And I get an attack. Well, he gets an attack. Of course, it's not the uh, the full-on melee attack, but it's still a punch, still damage. There we go. That's what this game is all about if you're trying to, to minimize the amount of... Uh, the amount of damage you take. And actually, it's not a waste for us to have an armed. An armed is good. It's going to be good right now. It's going to allow us to um, to get a lot of money with the trapper or with the trapper skins. Or actually, gecko skins. Uh, but it's also good later on because we're going to need to fight. And uh, it's, it, it's it's important. It's important to know how to fight. <laughs> I'll to punch. I'll throw a punch and I'm going to get hit. Ooh, I dodged. Nice. Oh, and that meant that he could use his sledgehammer. I saw that. Yeah, it's tricky. It doesn't always work. You need to... It's... It's... It... it yeah, it, it works. And there it is. Hoo-hoo. Okay. Well, that was not a rage quit. I just... I actually meant to just to start recording now that the guy's dead. But now that... That is a problem over there, isn't it? Okay, so like... What you be I, would, I want you to wait here. Want to take a little nap? Yeah, I'm gonna take a little nap. Okay. So, what I'm gonna do with that guy... So I'm going to try to sneak up on him, if I can, and he's going to run, but I'm going to run past him. Okay, Sulik is coming for no reason whatsoever, and now that he's running, there we go. Sulik, are you going to, what are you doing? I just need this guy not to be here, that's that's all I need, because we're going to kill him. It's easy to, uh, to corner him, it should be easy to corner him anyway, uh, and take a few shots, as long as he doesn't go down there. Please go over there. Please go, please go. Shh, shoo, shoo. Yeah, it's pretty slow. Yeah, turn that corner. Fantastic. Brilliant. Okay. And combat. Fantastic. Okay. He's gonna stay there. Don't melt my boots. It's possible. The boots melt. And now finally. Oh, it was open. I thought it was a trap. Or is this the thing that has a trap? Press shift. Uh, can't find any traps. Uh, also, I need to take a couple of healing powders. Well, let's just, just, just take one. And rest a little bit after that. You only need to rest, like, I think it's 12 hours or 8 hours. It doesn't... I don't really know. But there's no traps over here. And there's no... Oh, there's... Nice, 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 nice. We got healing. We got uh, boots. And uh, we, we are good. Please don't break your boots. Thank you. Okay. Now. Whew. Uh, let's see. Uh, did I pick... Yes, I picked comprehension. Good. Basically, you gain more skills from reading books, which is good. Um, so, we could wait for this guy... To just come back later or something. Oh, actually, I need to still like with me. No, no, look at the other way. Yeah, he's not gonna look the other way. Mm. Was looking so good what before. Be let's go, let's go. We have to what find this smiley be? trapper dude, and uh, it's gonna be tricky enough as it is. Okay, so he's staying over there, and we can end combat over here. It's ended. Okay, good, 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 good. Oh, a dead rat. Sure, let's go down. And here we are, in the underground area. So the reason why... Oh, there's a lot of these. I think I might be able to sneak up through here, but not actually sneak up. Maybe I could, actually. Look at how he's looking the other way. Oh, he's not looking the other way. Bye! This is not going to go well. No, oh, this is not going to go well. It's not going to go well. Let's see what Sulik decides to do. Or what they decide to do, to be honest. Okay, so like you really need oh this is gonna go terrible. This is awful. This just it's really, really dangerous. We're not equipped at all to deal with this situation at all. But I can do it, even if I need to make a few cuts to make this enjoyable for you. Let's just see. If I can find this guy if I can get this guy to attack me, and like that, okay. So without that guy actually attacking me, I can take a few punches over here, 58%, taking a few a little bit of damage. 
Oh, no, he's coming. Okay, so I might be able to kill him and run. Because that, that means that when I have just one, I will be able to kite him. And with Sulik landing his hits, he is now severely wounded. Not dead, but severely wounded. So, let's just go over here. I think that's going to be enough for at least one of them to not be able to attack me. And Sulik, I think, is close enough for that. Oh, yeah. Okay, so he's now... That's nine damage. He's still severely wounded. Let's go. Let's go. I should have gone a little bit up. Sulik is not going to be able to attack anybody right now. Well, it got a hit, but that's not enough, Sulik. That's not enough. Well, that means that I can kite, which means that I will be right back. I think it's going down. Well, I killed one of them already. So where's this guy? Over here. No, where is he? I... Over here? I can... Oh, yeah, he's almost dead. I'm gonna punch him to death. Punch him to death. Oh, no. Didn't punch him to death. He's gonna bite us. Mm, he missed. Oh, he's still not dead. I got lucky. I got really lucky. Okay, so this is actually great news. I didn't know you could kite them. But can you imagine if I hadn't taken the eight, uh, the nine action points? Because you can actually get by by just having six agility. It's not that big of a detriment. But running around kiting over here, it just makes it a whole lot more complicated. Uh, and we got another one coming in. Which is totally fine, because I'm going to do exactly the same strategy. And he is dead. And of course, I didn't mention it, but we're fighting golden geckos. Yes, that's right. We're fighting golden geckos, and uh, it's a little bit cheap. The fact that we're kiting these guys, but they are really, really hard. And uh, I'd rather they, 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 they weren't as hard as they are. Um, so where are we going? Well, we're going to the other side of this place, and I'm trying to figure out if there's anybody around. I do know that there's a lot of them to the south, and uh, Solik is after me. Yes, he is. Uh, I did take a little bit of damage there, but that's okay. There are more of them up there. Mm, there's eggs now? Glowing eggshell. Pieces of a broken eggshell. It glows. Oh, maybe well, there always were. I just... Hmm. Okay, so how many of them are there? Two of them over here. Uh, over through here, we got one of them over there. It's not too bad. Let's get out of here. Because I think I can, uh, I can actually avoid a whole lot of grief if I just go through here. Right? Hopefully. Mm hmm, looks like that's the case. Okay, let's go. Okay, don't break your boots. And then... Ooh, that's not a whole lot of grief avoided. That is really not... Oh, that is really not. Let's get out of here. <laughs> let's go through the no the northern parts. Yes, this, this, this has a lot of them. Let's go to the north. Two of them is better than three. That's definitely the case. And I really want to come back later and get the, uh, the, the pelts, because golden gecko pelts. Basically, that's what it is. Golden Gecko Pelts. Okay, another bout of uh, kiting around these guys. Or actually, kiting these guys around. That's how it should be said. And Sulik is nowhere to be seen. Oh, he's over there. Okay. He, I, he's kind of an integral part of this, uh, of this whole operation, isn't he? Actually, I just found out that you can kite these guys with even just seven action points. So you don't need nine. Nine helps. Uh, and I still get hit with nine. Every once in a while, but uh, I'll show you. I'll show you why. Uh, let me see. So what you want to have? It's a punch over there in this face. Three points of damage. And what you want to do is uh, you want to take advantage of uh, Sulik's strong attack. So look at that. Okay, so we're not in a good position over here. We're gonna go over there, and let's see what happens. Okay, that's a good position. So you use seven. Oh, this is not good because we're going directly to where he is. Okay, I'm gonna run a little bit. Uh, so it's just, you just need to use, okay, I think this might be good. Okay, so it's a little bit close, but it works. No, we're going all the way around. That's, that's I need I need to be down here. You see, this is what I was talking about. It, it's tricky, but you can do it. I'm just going to show you how to. Let's do it. Okay, so this is a good position, I believe. So it gets close, and you use seven action points to go to the side. And that's all. Just use seven, so it's close enough. Oh, he goes for a punch. Okay, let's go with six then. I know it's pretty close, but he doesn't attack you. Oh, damn it! What do I know? <laughs> but at least Sulik does his thing. Uh, but yeah, there's a there's a play. Well, it, I, I was able to do it before, but Seven does it. That's... I was able to... I promise you I was able to do it before. I promise I'm not lying. Please don't die. Thank you. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. 
That little sucker was tough. I, he killed me. He actually killed me twice. But, well, just once. Really, it was just once. And this time around, he was attacking Sulik. Huh. He's severely wounded. Yeah. Yeah. The tall, muscular tribal. He has a bone through his nose, facial tattooing, and a confident, composed demeanor. Is he really composed? I mean, he is. He's kind of a... Kind of an interesting personality. As long as we don't melt, melt our, boot, our boots, we'll be all right. Okay, so let's go in here. And, uh, oh no, they're coming. Get going. Okay, we're good. Oh, okay, yes. So, that which looks like a door leads to somewhere indeed. Let's do our thing here. And, uh, say hi to this guy. Oh, hello there, stranger. Please call me Smiley. I'm sure glad to see you. I thought I was going to die here for certain. I'm hurt too bad to get past these, those damn lizards on my own. Oh, man, what are, you, what are you doing down here? Well, I was caught more golden geckos north and west of Klamath than anywhere else. I, so I figured that all the golden geckos lead somewhere, someplace up here. Well, looks like you were right. Well, looks as though I was a little too right. I got in here okay, but then one of those damn geckos got behind me and damn near took my leg off. Just barely made it over here. Yeah, I wonder why they didn't finish you off. Well, I guess they don't like to crawl through the goo too much. I can't say I blame them. Sure burns off, burns if it gets uh, on your skin, but that doesn't seem to stop them from, link li from licking up the darn stuff like it was Buckner's best. Hmm, it's interesting. Well, enough gum flapping. Now let's get out of here. I figured that if I can join you, we uh, should be able to uh, make it out of here okay. I sure could use some help. Um... Let's see. Yeah, you can join me. I'll make sure you get out of here and back to Klamath. I think that Arden is going to be glad to see you again. Okay, so now we really need to get going because that guy is going to see me. Yeah, let's get going. Sulik, come. Yeah, we're not going to mess with those stuff, with that stuff. We are going to come back later. Uh, Sulik already melted his boots. Hopefully he doesn't die. Well, if we keep, if we go too fast or fast enough. He's an idiot. He is such an idiot. I didn't save. He's going to die. Prepare for... To see Sulik die. Okay. Sulik didn't die. But he's almost dead. Of course. <sighs> the nerve on this guy. Okay. So this guy wants to run. I really want to overtake him. What the hell is wrong with him? Yeah. Don't kill that guy. I really like for him not to die. Okay. At least Sulik is... I have no idea what Sulik is trying to do. <gasps> Basically, what happens is the boots melt. How did he not die there? I don't even know, but sure. Let's go, Sulik. And that guy, yeah, Smiley's gonna stay over there. He's gonna do his thing. Actually, I don't know if he's gonna do his thing. I think I should be able to stop combat over here. Maybe. Let's see. Let's see. Yes, I can. Okay. So, all I need to do is wait for him to come over here, and that's the quest done. Oh, hey, thanks for saving my ass. Sorry, ass. I better hightail it back to Klamath. See you there. Yep. And I get 75 karma and a thousand experience points for rescuing Smiley. And now, finally, we're gonna be actually. Sulik is really hurt. I get. What you be need? I've been needing to look at your stats, mate. He's got 22 health. Oh, it's pretty good. He's got 80, 80, 85 maximum. He's just phenomenal. So let's get out of here and uh, go back to Klamath and tell Arden about our awesome adventures it was really tough though it was really tough i thought it was gonna be easier than that but oh, i always knew it was gonna be tough but uh, i gained one perception i feel very nauseous but that's not because of radiation i don't think it actually might be uh that's actually quite bad because we gain radiation when outside but that's fine that's all good uh it's, it's all good it's all good hey arden how oh, you're the one that found Sm smiley thank you thank you so much yeah, Smiley got lucky this time. You just tell him to tell him to be a uh, a bit more careful, huh? How well? I just don't know what we could ever do to thank you. Uh, well, money is always nice a nice way to say thanks. I don't have much, so here's a, a hundred. I wish it could be more, but with all the bravin we've lost, that's all we can afford. I'm sorry. Yeah, thanks, Miss Buckner. Goodbye. And you can karma if you refuse that, but I need the money. Oh, mm, where's Smiley? Smiley's over there. Uh, I sure owe you for saving my hide. Least I can do is teach you some something in return. Uh, yeah. Thanks, Smiley. I'd sure appreciate any tips you could give me. Well, since those geckos nearly had my hide, let me teach you how to get theirs. So uh, here's how you skin them, and Smiley demonstrates. And when you kill them, you can cat, you can get their hides and sell them. Okay? Whoa. Thanks. I 
thanks for showing me how to do that, Smiley. I think so. I think I'll go practice on some geckos. Bye. And that's that. That's all I needed. That's all I really needed because now we can talk to um. What's it? Whiskey Bob over here? That's his name. You see an older man with a scraggly beard and a big red nose. That's Whiskey Bob right there. We know what his job is. We're also going to be able to talk to Tor over there. Um, and, uh, well, we actually could have done that before. But now we can focus on Klamath for real. Because now we have Gecko Skinning. You are a, you have the knowledge of how to skin geckos properly to get your to get their hides. My hide is already mine. And I actually healed up a little bit. Not a whole lot. Uh, but enough for us to... Uh, not be too too bad too bad off because you know going outside and just traveling outside is enough for us to, to heal up over time and all that but for right now i'm Colonel rpg and this has been fallout 2 i really hope you've enjoyed it and if you did go ahead and leave a comment like the video but above all thank you so much for watching and i hope i'll see you next episode bye, -bye.